IBNX Radio. Um, and then uh, we're going to keep it moving. We ready to go into our next interview, everybody? I sure hope so, because I'm just going to keep on rolling right on over there. It is eight years. Eight years. And they working me like eight years running Red Slave. It's all right, though. That's what we do. How you doing, baby? Hey. Hi, Miss Keisha. How you doing? I'm doing good. How about yourself? Blessed and highly favored. You, you look like you're blessed. <laughs> you look like it. <laughs> So we are just rolling with things. I just have one interview to the next one. So Miss Keisha, tell us who we know. Your name is Keisha, but what do you do? Okay, so I am Keisha J, formerly known as Wanda, from okay. the hit reality show South Beach Toe from Miami. Okay, all yes, right. Yeah. So you funny and pretty. Well, thank you. Yeah, okay. I take it as a compliment. Okay. You, know, you, you, you we take them all, all of them. Yes, all of them. So thank you so much you for much. joining us. Um, so we're gonna go ahead because, of course, I was doing other views, so I can get a chance to read over your bio, but it's okay. It's okay. We'll make, I'm gonna just we, go ahead and reintroduce myself. Yeah, that, it, sometimes that's what it takes because they don't hit for the people in the back. Yeah, that's yeah, for, right. <laughs> for the people in the, the back. The ones in the back. For the ones in the back. <laughs> um, so we do know that, that you are formerly of the show, mm -hmm. and so what are you currently working on now? Well, uh, I have a big announcement. Okay. I can't tell much details, okay. but I am super excited to to let everybody know that my reality show is finally getting ready to. You take. got the green light. Oh my goodness! When I tell you, it took seven years. Really? And I am the direct. Um, I am the writer of the show. Okay. I came up with the concept, and basically, um, if you know, is it the, the real is on YouTube. Okay. The real is on YouTube. Um, I am. I do have my own company. Okay. It's called Keisha J Productions. I'm into film. I partnered up with my partner with um, New Magic Productions. Um, we do. We do writing scripts, filming. You name it, we do it. Okay. Um, I have um, some shows coming out. That's that's you know it's slowly but surely coming to place. I started, but just I'm gonna just let you know my little backstory. Please I, do. We want to hear. We have to wanna, hear the backstory. We, we, we want to hear the story. We have to so know let the me truth. tell you. Okay. So I'm from Miami. Okay. okay. I'm not. I'm not all hood, but I'm from Miami. You 305. 305. All in the right. Building. Okay. I'm from Miami, and I started off as a writer. I okay. was always writing. I, okay. I had I had a passion for writing and directing, and I was always into play, stage plays. Okay. And this was way before Tyler Perry came out. Okay, I, you know that shows you how old I am. So I was into writing. How seasoned you are. How the season, seasoned, it's the right. wisdom, the amount you know, of wisdom that you have. You know, but the Lord has really restored my youth, and yes. I really thank God for that because you know at one time I looked like somebody's grandma, but you know, just a little bit, and a little Vaseline right. olive oil will change. <laughs> but however, I love writing, and you know, I always wanted to be behind the camera. Okay, that was just me. But I started off in. Doing stage plays at in Miami, I I did a whole production, okay, written it, directed it, produced it, you know, cast it, did all of the nine yards, got good got good reviews on it, and kind of find out I end up on television. I used to be a photographer, right? Okay. And I used to be in the industry as a photographer. So I worked I worked with everybody like with Kirk Franklin, Dr. Bobby Jones, I met Vicky Winans, I met Shirley Caesar, I met I've I've been on around the these gospel, people. On the gospel on trail. the gospel side. But then mm -hmm. when it came to the R and B side, mm -hmm. I met I mean young Lloyd, I met I I mean I met them all. Okay. And I met young Jock when he had just came out. It was back in 2007. And you came out without a baby. Huh? Ooh, right. You about, yes. <laughs> yes. When, back in, in Miami Beach. I, you know, yes, I hugged him one time and they survived without a baby. So welcome to the club. We survived, <laughs> girl. Shout out to Young Jack. <laughs> yeah, ahead. but... But, you know, I was able to work around these people. Mm -hmm. and, and I'm like, wow. You know, I, I, you know, photography, I love pictures. But I ended up on television. And how I ended up on television... Was I had something unique that I guess they were looking for. Okay. And I had, that day I had blonde, I had blonde hair, I went blonde. And also I had, um, you know, I walked with a limp because I was born with spinal bifida. So okay. one of my legs was shorter than the other. Okay. So they thought I had a little swag, you know. A little pit walk. A little, a little and pit it is a little pit walk. And I went and they, and I, you know, auditioned and they saw me and I said, wait a minute, we want you. But didn't know I was going to be on this show for 
so long. I thought I was going one time, one hit a quitter, quitter. you know, mm -hmm. that's it. And let me tell you, it taught me so much because I always told myself, once I get, if I was to ever get famous, I'm, I'm very, very humble person. I'm not going to be get big headed, anything like that. And I've always been like that. And I stayed true to my, my calling. So I went from that, went on TV. I had the show in it in 2014. Okay. And I ended up moving to Georgia. So I came to Georgia, place I've never really lived. And I actually said, this is where I'm going to start pursuing my career. So I, you know, I, I tried to, you know, I started meeting some big people. I've worked with Tyler Perry. I've worked, I've, I've did a lot of guest appearances. I met all the housewives of Atlanta. I've met, you know, and I, and I don't mean meet them. I mean sat and actually had a conversation mm -hmm. with I'm them. Saying. See, that's important. It is. You have to sit and actually have a conversation with these people mm -hmm. because that's how they're going to remember who you are and you know till this day i can make phone calls if i want to and just to check up on you know hey how you doing you know and they know and you they build know a me. rapport and a, right. a genuine connection right so they know me as wanda they know me as wanda because of the show my real name is keisha but you know they don't know me as Wanda. but you know don't check it sound right baby that's always <laughs> don't the check it sound right you understand that was a check it sound right <laughs> but but nevertheless um mm -hmm. the move fast forward the show ended um and to bring it kind of current, 2019 was my 2020. Um, okay. I ended up um, getting diagnosed with charcoal neuropathy in my left foot. Um, it's deterioration of the bones okay. where your foot deteriorates and, okay. uh, and, and, and it deforms. Mm -hmm. And right after that, um, I had just thought I just celebrated my third third wedding anniversary and like five days after that, I was getting ready to transition. I was my husband was planning my funeral. Oh, wow. I um I had <clears throat> my foot actually got infected mm -hmm. and I contracted C diff, which is another virus, and both viruses were attacking all of uh, my everything. internal organs. Mm -hmm. So it was shutting down my organs and I had to end up on dialysis. Okay. So I you know, so right now I go to dialysis. But I'm telling you But the beauty in that story is y'all y'all finna miss your blessing. The beauty in story she said right now. Right. Because exactly. that was then, that was right then. now. Don't miss that. Right. Catch that. Right. So in the midst of me actually going through the the, the pain that I'm going through, mm -hmm. I still tend to run my business. I still tend to have faith in the dreams that I'm trying to, you know, I'm not trying, but I am going to accomplish because I have to speak it. And I, you know, and I'm just excited because God had me here for a purpose. Mm -hmm. He has me in this this field for a purpose because there's a message that needs to get across. And he actually used me to show himself. And I and, and I accept that. And a lot of people a lot of people don't understand that because it because when I went when I went on Facebook um on my anniversary, I actually just celebrated my fifth year anniversary. Congratulations, Thank you. Black yeah, Love. Yeah, my wedding person. Shout out to my husband if he watching. Hey, shout out to you. Come, on. Shout out to come yeah. on, Black Love. Yeah, so, five is a number of new beginnings. Thank you. Yes, it is. Five is a number of new beginnings. Yes. So we ended up going to California okay. for our anniversary. But nevertheless, there was a t um, my my Facebook showed me a video um, that was taken that year that I was getting ready to transition, and I said, "Wow!" I said that would that was the last video that was taken of me before I passed away. The last video. Cause we were, he cooked me a a, a, um, a seafood boil, and we sat on live and we actually interacted with the fans while we were eating our seafood, and that was the actually that was the last video that was taken of me before I was getting ready to transition over. And mm. I said, "Wow!" I said, "God allowed me to see, you know, more anniversaries. Mm -hmm. That was going to be the last anniversary, mm -hmm. three years." But nevertheless, when I tell you, I'm just, um, I'm just honored and blessed to be here because it's just, you know, this message got to get across. But nevertheless, I, I, I mean, I'm happy to be here. And we're happy to have you. We're happy, happy to for be you to be here. So, one, congratulations. Thank you. Uh, congratulations. Um, the, and it was a beautiful transition because it, it took you just from glory to glory. That's all that it did. It did. That's mm -hmm. all that it did. And then, two, congratulations on five years. Yes. Woo. 
<laughs> yes, and then another congratulations on making it because it's, it's not right. easy to it's go right. after. It's, it's not right. easy to go after your dream, not at all. It's so congratulations right. on all of that. So tell briefly tell us a little bit what you can about your reality show. Okay, so. I'm going to say what I can say. What you can say. Just know um, it's, it's going to be a, on a major platform. Okay. Okay. And it consists of my mother-in-law, me, and my husband. Okay. Um, which, you know, my mother-in-law, she's not there. But, you know, you, you met her. That, that was my mother <laughs> Okay. So, <laughs> so it consists of us three. We are a typical family um, that we were trying to bring change to other families especially in our black community okay because typically mother-in-laws don't get along with their daughter-in-laws and leave it right there don't right. talk no more exactly y'all gotta go tune in that's right y'all gotta go that's tune right. in make sure <laughs> give me your social media information we, <laughs> and make sure you all go and follow her and everything and we're looking forward to that like i said just tell them that don't need nothing else what's your right. social media information darling? okay so you can follow me on instagram is wanda underscore south beach toe that's my main instagram and then my business is Keisha J Productions with two E's. Keisha, K E E S H A J Productions. And then for those who do Facebook, if y'all do Facebook, it's Keisha Wanda Jackson. So. All right, so there it is. Make sure that you go and if you do have a dream, she has a production company. Support her business by support I mean Keisha pay. J Productions. Yes, <laughs> yes, that is our time. Thank you so much for sharing your testimony You're and your vision and what's to come. And congratulations on everything. Thank so we're going to move on to our next interview because you yeah. see how they work in there. Yeah, I see it. I, I see, see it. How y'all I see it. it. <laughs> so we, we, moving right along, we're we taking a break or we drop, hop into the next one. The break? Okay, all right. You see how they work in me. I see how all right, I'm going to need some water, some Hennessy or something. <laughs> like, I mean, a bit of harm. But can I get some sustenance, some crackers? <laughs> IBNX Radio.